Okay guys, so uh, if you want to install a plugin like this one, siding bar, one click, it will display uh, any content, what you like. So uh, I will show you now how to do this. So log into your WordPress website. Then go to plugins, add new. Here you should search for side siding widgets. Here it is. Click install. Activate plugin. So here it is, siding widgets. Here is the setup. Here you should put uh, uh, box uh, siding box size. So for me it's like this. I have already some setup, and I will simply copy it now. We'll copy it now from my uh, other version of website so here is link to your image so you should upload it uh, your image to your WordPress website simply click on media add new and when you will upload your image you'll be able to get this link and simply put it here okay I will Paste now all sizes. Um, so we'll position from left, distance from left, position left, distance from top, position left. Okay, now save it. So now you can see that this uh, something displaying wrong. Uh, I will show you now how to fix that, but uh, first of all, need to uh, add your siding box. To do so, go to um, Go to Appearance Widgets, I think. Let me check. Yes, Appearance, appearance Widgets, Appearance Widgets and Siding Widget. Here you should, uh, I, will, I will put here uh, HTML code, eframe code, so I will need here to drag and drop TXT like this. And in content, I should put my content. So let me check. I will search now for my code. Okay. Appearance widgets. So here is my code. Save. Now let's uh, check first. So here is widget, but we need to fix this log. How to fix it? Simply click on right click view page source. Oh, no, 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 inspect, inspect, yes. 
click here and select element like this and here we can see all settings for this element so here it is so for example if I will edit this and background size we can see how this changes so you can experiment here and simply copy when you have found the right way what works for you you need to copy this element I will show you now I will, I will explain you now I will simply copy I have already done this I will copy and paste it to my another website version and will show you now so I will go to team options and I will need to search for my custom CSS file and include here this code <coughs> Let me check first. Yes, as you can see, it's uh, working good now. So I'll click open and click close. So uh, what I have done is here is the code. So simply, let me show you once again. Simply click on right click on element, click inspect, click here, select element, click on element. So here is our element, and right click is uh, styles. Scroll here, you can see uh, our element. So I need to copy this one and put brackets and I need to uh, copy background size, background position I can experiment here, put uh, values instead of this one and then simply go to custom CSS file and paste it here and add important so is this, is this means it will overwrite this style so this is how it works like guys as you can see all working great and if you need any help with this please uh, comment under this video and you will find all my contacts I can help you to set up this form um, this sidebar if you need okay guys have a nice day bye